Woke up the morning, feel rejuvenated. Hundred bands on me, y'all. I accumulated. If it ain't about a bag, ain't affiliated. So what JB Hunt done was, hold on, let me get out the way. I don't want to get hit. So what uh, JB Hunt done was they changed the load on me. So now they gave me a load that picks up today that they already have. And they swapped the load that's supposed to be loaded tonight. They swapped it. Now I got a new load, so I gotta check and see if this load's ready. It's supposed to be ready at three o'clock. Right now it's four o'clock. So let's see if I can grab it. Hey, how y'all doing? Good thing, Jazz. I don't have to work. Yeah. <laughs> How you doing, sir? I forgot my phone on working here. Oh, this is mine. Oh. <laughs> hey, Bond trucking on YouTube, man. Check it out. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, I've been trying to do it big on YouTube. You got a little podcast or something? Uh, I do uh, vlogging. I do, uh, I do uh, in, I mean, er, educational videos, you know, like yeah. how to lease successfully, how to become an owner-operator, stuff like that. <laughs> so I try to do my thing. So Bond trucking. Bond? Yeah, like B James Bond. B-O-N-D? Yes. Bill Wendy Trucking. Alright. Even if I don't do that, I'm going to subscribe to you. Alright. Appreciate it. Okay. I have a pickup, JB Hunt. Okay. They gave me a new number. The last. Let, let, let me see whatever you think the number is 10, 14, 14. Okay, that would be, yeah. That's all I need. Yeah, because they gave me, I had another load, so they switched the load because they said this one was already ready for me. So I could just come and get this one for them. 10, 14, 14. Have you talked to anybody besides me? No. JB Hunt? I'm sorry? No, J no, no. I, I didn't know if somebody already talked to you about what to do with your trailer yet. Why don't uh, you just sign a date those anywhere at the bottom for me, please? Yes, uh, I, I've been here, I was here about five hours ago. Well, I was here a few hours ago. And, you uh, have a, you're not hooked to a trailer. No, I already dropped it. I dropped it at 9 That's or what something. I'm trying to get at, yeah. Okay. Now, you want me to... Signature date anywhere at the bottom. It doesn't matter to me. Signature okay. date anywhere at the bottom. Yes, date. sir. And today yeah. is... 8519. All right, uh -huh. this machine should be mine. Rest of your year. You should have a safe trip. Thank you, sir. This place here is nothing to play with. It's very tight. He got to back up just to let him in. So they, they trying to figure it out. But this place here is tight. So what I'm gonna try to do is, huh? He got a fairly light load. This load here is twenty six thousand pounds. So. I'm gonna put it in the California hole and I'm gonna go back to the truck stop that's down the street. Right now, I'm a little bit over half a tank of fuel, but this is only 200 miles, 240 miles. So by it being 240 miles, I don't have to do much extra. I don't have to buy any extra fuel. I'm trying to get it clear before I leave. I don't have any I don't have to buy any extra fuel to make this load get there. But I can buy I have to buy fuel once I get there because I got to idle tonight. So I still got to buy some fuel once I get this load done and that fuel will go on to my next load plus idle plus my idling on my 10 hour break. So I have to do all of that. And then once I get through with all of that, then 
I move to the next low. Fueling on leasing is a very important part. If you don't know how to, if you don't know how to fuel your truck right, and you still fuel your truck like a company driver, your paychecks go look like a company driver. Because most of your money is gonna be going in your fuel tank. That's where you're gonna lose all your money in. So that's one thing that you gotta try to not do. You gotta try to make sure you manage your fuel. Because once you, if you manage your fuel, you're good. Now, I talked to a couple of other drivers and they were prime drivers or ex-prime drivers. And they'll tell you, well, they told me stuff like, oh man, you supposed to drive 58 miles an hour. You supposed to manage your fuel. You, man, I'm, I'm no, I'm not doing that. If, I feel like this, if, if you go manage your fuel and drive 58 miles an hour, you got to drive 11 hour days. You gonna have to do 34 hour restarts to get less money than I'm going to make at the end of the week. Now, I know, I know they're going to argue me up and down, but at the same time, they go make the same amount of money that I made. If I drive seven hours a day for seven days and they drive 10 hours a day and have to do a restart on, they, on, on their seventh day because they done ran out of hours. I done, I done redone it like 10 times to make sure if I was right before I spoke about it. And I'm right about that. If your truck goes 73 miles an hour, 75 miles an hour. Run that because they're drum, they're running four loads. They're running four loads. Making what they what making what they're making. And I'm running five loads making I say at least $500 more that week. I want to say it's actually seven, but take away the $200 that they're saving running 53 miles an hour. Now, I know I'm going to get some blowback on this, but it is what it is. I mean, I did my homework. It only makes sense to a company that's got 10,000 plus trucks. 53 miles an hour saves them fuel. Think about it like this. If you save $10 for 10,000 trucks, imagine how much money that is. That's the reason why they preach that. They don't preach that because it makes sense to the individual driver. They preach that because it makes sense to their company. And then we see that and hear that and we think that we supposed to do that when we're a single truck operation. But to each his own. Found it. I definitely wasn't expecting to work today. Oh, this truck here. You ain't got no trailer on the back. I guess it's my foot, cause I'm so used to being a heavy hitter over here. But man, this this thing gets up and go. Truck went down, trailer went up, and then I should be good. But I'm gonna still do it. I'm gonna pick this trailer up and I'm gonna take it to Jamesboro, Ohio. This is where I'm at. 
and um don't forget to subscribe hit the bell oh yeah this is the end of this video my facebook is bond trucking do me a favor and swing by there give me a like i put some of my parts of my videos that don't make the video i put it on there and my instagram is bond trucking 17. i'm not gonna hold y'all I'm out. Yeah, hustler, all the year, yeah, I'm nominated. Went to jail, I ain't full, I've been populated. It's a stick. Hold a hundred, don't make me demonstrate it. Ain't nothing low key, I've been cooling, baby. Yeah, I think about it, yeah.